City officials in La Crosse are figuring out how to spend federal funding over the next five years. First News at 9's Dash Mensel shares the plan the city is putting together and how the community can help. As the city of La Crosse develops their 2025 to 2029 consolidated plan, they're looking for community feedback. We really are looking to the community to tell us what those areas are. So, um, you know, if there's maybe an area we haven't been focusing on previously that we can look to in the future, incorporating that into our next five year plan. The consolidated plan is updated every five years and is federally funded through the Housing and Urban Development Department, giving the city $1 million annually. We are finishing up one five-year plan right now where we spent a lot of our time repairing homes, building homes, and funding public services, as well as some affordable housing projects as well. Um, and this is really a great opportunity for us to look to the next five years and see what we'd like to see in our community. The city is releasing a survey to help decide areas to be looked at. The last consolidated plan saw many people focus on housing, but the city says there could be other topics brought up this time around. It's always interesting to get feedback from the community. Um, we look forward to seeing if there are any new trends. The city plans to do more work on the plan after the survey results are in. Coming around the new year um, is when we'll probably have some more kind of public forum sessions, things like that, um, to and hopefully some more one-on-one um, -on -one consultations as well, and really hoping that we can use this survey to collect, you know, some key areas to focus on in the coming new year. In La Crosse, Dasha Menzo, First News at 9. And the next five years of the plan will begin this April. The community input survey is open until December 8th.